everyone, Jay Pop Lover 1000 here with the Brats on the Mic out of country exclusive Jade and Chloe. Uh, huge, huge thanks to Brad Shady18. Thank you, girl, for sending me these. Um, I already shipped off your package, so I really hope you like the dolls you're getting. So, for all my states followers or subscribers, um, these are out of country exclusives. You cannot get these in the U.S., unfortunately. Um, so I was very fortunate to have such a great friend in Belgium to send these to me. So thanks again, Brad Shady18. Um, I was super looking forward to getting these dolls. I actually really wanted them when I saw the promo pictures of them. Um, I know they're a little more on the basic side compared to the original on the mic dolls, but I really liked I really liked them. I thought they were cute. Um, so I'm going to start over here with Jade. She is super, super cute. Of course, she's going to have the 2010 uh, facial screening since these dolls are a couple years old now. Um, so you can see the back of the box has the on the mic design, of course. And unlike the original dolls that have highlights, she just has her plain uh, black hair with brown highlights. And this is her face. And then this is her earring mold. Very, very cute. And then her outfit is the same as the second wave of the on the mic dolls. Uh, the first wave had the shimmery dresses. I'm not sure if anyone remembers, but the second wave had the more denim look, which I preferred a lot better. And then she has her black boots. And then she actually comes with um, a removable wig thing. I call it a weave because it's not technically a wig. It's like hair extensions. Um, it's all crimped and then she, it's all red with black highlights in the bangs. It's crimped and you can tell it's nylon because of the cruddy quality, unfortunately. Uh, she comes with a red microphone as well. And here it says, get your concert style on with rockin' hair extensions. Which I don't consider this hair extensions. I consider like separate little clips of hair hair extensions, but what are you going to do? And she comes with a silver signature Brett star brush. And this is the bottom of her box. Very, very cute. And then here's the back of Jade's box. It says Brad's on the mic and it says rock out with star style. And then of course in other languages. And then these are the Wave 2 prototype dolls. Um, I kind of wish they didn't show these on the box. I wish they showed like the actual dolls from this line. Uh, with the uncolored hair with like maybe their hair extensions in or something. I don't know. I'm tired of MGA's false advertisement. It gets a little old. Actually it is really old. They've been doing it for years. Um, then you can also look for the Bratz on the mic speaker and microphone, which they sold separately. I know that they sold a red one in the States. I'm not sure um, about outside the country. But yeah, so that's the back of Jade's box. And here is Chloe, who was the original one I wanted. I'll just show you her box here quick. Her artwork is by far my favorite. It's just so, so pretty. And she just has her plain platinum... Uh, I just said platinum, platinum blonde hair. Then here is her face. Very simple makeup, just peach and like a light violet eyeshadow. So it's just keeping it simple. She's got purple earrings, which are again a new mold, which is very exciting. Uh, this is her denim outfit, which like I said, is the same as the Wave 2 dolls. And then she's got purple hair extensions with blonde in the bangs, and it's all curly and matted at the end, which you can tell is nylon, unfortunately, but... And they make it look so good and curly and saran there, which is very unfortunate. So, yeah, and then you already saw the back of Jade's box, so they're exactly the same. So thank you guys for watching my review. Actually, a really quick review. It's only three minutes long so far. On the Bratz on the Mic Out of Country exclusive dolls. Sorry I shake so much. <laughs> I just am very shaky, I guess. Uh, let me know what you guys think down in the comment section. What do you think of these dolls? Are they a yay or a nay for you? Um, if you guys have them, what do you guys think of them? What is the quality of them? I can tell that they have nylon hair, but I know some nylon is better than others, depending on what Ed and Gia uses. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for more review, guys, and I'll see you later. Bye!